that's me, Arnie. Today is Jay's birthday, and George said she'd buy her gift for him. I wonder what's keeping her. Ah! Well, George comes over eating some chips. All right, George, now what's the big surprise for Jay? A frisbee? That sounds good. George suggests we test it out. So George and I head over to try it out. Okay, let it fly. Still waiting. Wait, let me show you how it's done. You just move your arm like this and let it go. Well, she's starting to improve. Be careful, those woods are full of snakes. I decided to really let it fly this time. In hindsight, a parking lot wasn't the best place to play. So we moved to a safer area, away from vehicles. There goes Jay to get a free roll of duct tape. We're starting to get the hang of it when I launch it onto the roof. So I start climbing up the side, toss it down, only to have it hook into a window. It was about 15 windows down from the center of the building. Here we go. Nobody home. But this isn't going to stop George. She attempts to pick the lock while I cover her. After a while, she gives up, and I give it a shot. Look, it's unlocked. Time to make a fast getaway. We moved to the disc golf course. I stepped up to tee off, and it was looking good. Until it ended up in the pond. I was measuring the distance to see if I had enough duct tape to make it that far, while George tried to call it back in. I did find a stick that would do. George happened to be in the way. Boy, it's slippery out here. It's a good thing I had that stick. I managed to hook the frisbee, and on to the next hole we go. George feels pretty confident in this, and decides that she wants to go first. 
must have been watching the Olympics as she spins around and lets it fly. Wait, come back! Once we got our frisbee back, we decided to move on to another hole. Oh, poor guy. I don't know how I managed that one. Well, his heart is still beating. We decided we should make him a little more comfortable. just to leave the frisbee with him. Oh, and the card. Let's get out of here. 